Hey everyone, uh, I'm Bob Blackhurst uh, with Coldwell Banker Preferred out of Pike Creek. Um, welcome to my tour of Two Malvina. brand new door um, and I'll just show you give you a quick rundown of the outside um, you've got new windows this section right here on the right this actually used to be a garage um, it was converted into a fourth bedroom with all the uh, necessary permits required hey, welcome welcome um, so, as you, as I hope you're able to tell, you've got uh, brand new flooring. That's a uh, luxury, uh, luxury uh, vinyl plank. You have an open living room, kitchen area. Um, obviously, brand new granite countertops, um, undermounted sink. This is nice. The white kitchen is what most buyers are, are into right now. So you have that here um, along with uh, the stainless steel appliances. It's a brand new electric stove, uh, Whirlpool microwave. And new fridge. Um, as I uh, as I had said, they did convert the uh, third bedroom, the, uh, the, I'm sorry, the garage into a fourth bedroom. So uh, a lot of the houses in this neighborhood, Chestnut Hill Estates, um, they've got kind of a unique setup in the sense that you have uh, your main bedroom here, right? Uh, as far as the, the ranch model goes, you have your main bedroom here. You have a second bedroom here, but that comes with the outside access to the backyard. So... Um, if you like that, great. There's no need to do anything. If you don't like that, you have a couple of options. You could, of course, remove the doors, change that into just a regular wall. What I personally would do, if I was somebody that you know only happened to need a three bedroom, is I would convert this into um, some sort of like a den or or, uh, or or just kind of like a family room area. Um, I would do that by getting rid of this door right here and maybe and maybe increasing the size of the uh, of the entryway into the room. But we'll check out the uh, backyard in a moment. Um, you also do have a closet in here, by the way. So uh, brand new carpet on the floor as well. This is going to be your biggest bedroom. This is going to be the main bedroom. You do have um, your electrical panel in here as well. Um, and uh, you can you might be able to see the, the sticker. It was just inspected um, on May 12th of 2020, so that's good. Plenty of closet space. Got a nice view of the backyard as well. Um, speaking of the yard, it is one of the biggest lots in the neighborhood. Um, a lot of the homes that recently sold in this neighborhood actually did not offer much of a yard at all. Um, so something to point out if you're studying uh, comparables. Uh, here's your third bedroom, decent size. Um, you have a closet here on your left. Again, nice view of the backyard. And your, uh, your fourth bedroom. This was the garage. 
New lighting fixtures, of course, really in the whole house. It's all new lighting, all new paint, all new carpets, all new, all new uh, flooring, um, new doors. So uh, these homes were originally built with one bathrooms, with, I'm sorry, with one baths, um, many of them. This has been converted into a two full bathroom. You also have laundry hook up here. Um, so as you might be able to tell, I mean, one of the reasons that I use the GoPro to, to film these, these uh, walkthroughs is the wide angle really gives you a good idea of the, of the space of the room. Um, so you have a very good sized bathroom. You have uh, a stand up shower, of course, new tile. A new vanity and a new toilet, of course, as well. And just a small reminder that we are blessed. That comes with the house. <laughs> um, so that's that's your that's one of the main bathrooms. Now remember, you do still have another full bath. This one is, of course, closer to the um, common areas of the house, like the living room and kitchen. So I would say that this is probably going to be the bathroom that your, your guests are more likely to use. Um, brand new tile going almost all the way up and you can see this cut in. This is marble. It looks, it looks great. I believe this is marble as well, if you can see that. Uh, new tub, new toilet, new oversized vanity. Hey, um, that's your attic access. They, uh, the builder on this did a really good job of taking care of this, the things that, that really matter. So for instance, um, the utilities have been changed over. So this house has been converted from oil to gas. I, I believe that's accurate. Oil to gas. Yeah, I know it's gas now. I just, I'm just not sure if they, I'm pretty sure it was converted from oil though. Um, it's definitely gas now. Um, you have an electric hot water heater. Um, it's brand new. It's got an expansion, expansion tank on it already. Um, so your inspector is not going to flag it for that. <laughs> um, new thermostat. Uh, I believe the uh, gas furnace was actually installed into the um, attic. And of course, newer energy efficient windows here. And they're the uh, easy clean. Um, they were all also recently capped. Uh, the gutters are new as well. The roof is new as well. So if you're looking for turnkey, if you're looking for low maintenance, um, high enjoyability, if you're looking for something that you can just simply move right in and start enjoying